Hello, I'm Klaus Robbins from the Museum in the Microscope in Mülheim, Germany. And I want to show you how the blitz copy, the first modern process of photocopying, which was successful, worked. It was invented by Edith Weide in 1938 and parallel but independently from Andre Roth in Belgium at Gevert. Edith Weider was a chemist at Aqua in Leverkusen and she came to invent this very quick photographic process which is one of the most important innovations in the history of photography. And it works like this. I have a sens sensible to light negative, you see it here. And I have a positive, which could be a double-sided too, here. And in this copying box, with heavy pressure, I, give, I expose it for 45 seconds. And to pass the 45 seconds, let me show you how good a blitz copy, a copy repeat copy was in 1961. This copy is an original copy from this prospectus from 1961. And you see it's quite amazing good. It's a photographic process, it's not a dry process like xerography. <clears throat> you have to use one bath only and you don't need a dark room for that which made it suitable for the office use. And the process is like follows. I have, a <clears throat> I have a positive paper which isn't sensitive to light, but it contains nuclei to develop the unexposed parts in the negative. And all I have to do is pass it through one bath, the so-called activator, which is quickly done by a pair of plastic rollers. This is brought together and as you see, immediately a negative image appears. And the negative is developed and not sensible to light anymore and the unexposed parts of the negative are diffusing to the positive paper where they are reduced to metallic silver and make the final photocopy. And this in the first days took <clears throat> almost um, two minutes and in the highest point of it, and I'll show it to you shortly so so you can see the negative can you see it okay and in the early days it took two minutes and at the end of this development of modern photocopy it just took a few seconds and all we have to do is to separate the negative from the positive and we see a slightly faded photocopy which is because this material is 40 years old and the negative paper works better than the positive paper. Okay? And that's how a blitz copy worked. Thanks. Bye.